7 Signs You're Stuck with a Spiritual Narcissist Hello everyone. Having a narcissist presence in your life, either at home or work, can be a very strenuous and challenging life for you and the other people around you. You might think that you understand someone, but you are left bewildered when they reveal their true colors. Narcissists are already known, but I bet you never knew that there are spiritual narcissists. These use spirituality to justify their doings and get what they want. Stay tuned because the following are 7 signs that show you're stuck with a spiritual narcissist. But as usual guys, I hope you can help this channel to gain more vibration by clicking that like button below and do subscribe to this channel if you're new here. 1. They don't take responsibility for their erring. Spiritual narcissists are perfectionists because they don't see any mistake in whatever they do. They believe that they're always right, even if someone points out an error in what they might have done. They still make sure to lie their way out of that situation and convince you that you're the strong one and they're correct. They don't care how many people say they're wrong, everyone is wrong and they're right. 2. They don't abide by their teachings. Spiritual narcissists will never practice what they teach. They believe in the philosophy of do what I preach and not what I do. All they do is make big claims of what they've done, which in reality are all fallacious. Whenever they try to put their preaching into actions, they always fail because it's not to do those things they preach. A spiritual narcissist might preach to you about giving but will never give to someone in need. 3. They always try to bring others down. Narcissists naturally have serious insecurity issues, and this problem often tends to make them want to pull other people down. They feel that by pulling others down, they might feel justified and control and manipulate them more easily. They never want to hear that someone else is doing better than them, and for that reason, you'll never get any word of encouragement from such people. Instead, they will always try to make other people around them feel inferior. 4. They are selfish. Narcissists are selfish people. They don't give a damn concerning the feelings of another person, but themselves. All the time of their life, they're always thinking about themselves only. They will never listen to anybody, whether in a group or a private chat. They believe that they're better than everyone else, so it is always about them, and the opinions of others are not necessary. Wherever they find themselves, they must speak, and whatever they say must be final. No one is permitted to express their opinions as it does not matter. 5. They use spirituality as an excuse for their behavior. Spiritual narcissists know that what they are doing is wrong, but they go on instead to do it. Then they cover it up on the pretext of being spiritual. They always have a spiritual backup for every wrong action they take and they use it very well to their advantage. Spirituality, as we all know, leads so many people to do so many things, but narcissists exploit this fact, and people find it hard to question them since they always have a spiritual backing to the atrocities they commit. 6. They always see mistakes in others. No one is perfect. As we all have our faults and flaws, no one flaunts their mistakes. The narcissists think that they're perfect, so they're always trying to correct other people. They feel they know more than every other person, and thus the people should always take correction from them. They believe that by correcting others, they're better than them. They give unsolicited advice and pretend to be thoughtful about things they have no idea about. 7. They think they're the best. The power complex in narcissists is prevalent, stanching from their complicated minds and lack of self-esteem. They feel that they are the best in everything they do. This is because that is what their ego has shown them. But little do they fail to understand that their ego projects only things that raise it higher and not the reality. So guys, what do you think of this video? Please don't hesitate to share your thoughts and experiences in the comment section below. Stay tuned on this channel and see you in the next video.